we received a desperate call from Christina. My brother had a bike accident in Manila. He had a bad head injury and fracture of lower limbs, was on a holiday with friends. Our team at HI Flying Manila flew him in a helicopter from the clinic in Borkray and after stabilization, medevac him back home to the United States. Our objectives in the management of traumatic brain injury include limiting the primary damage and controlling secondary insults, which are thrust upon the brain immediately after an accident. We followed all the recommendations of guidelines approved by the American Association of Neurological Surgeons. At the primary care clinic in Borkeray, and oxygenization was given to the patient to maintain systolic blood pressure at around 100. Upon stabilization of the hemodynamic and pulmonary function, the patient was transferred rapidly by ground ambulance to the helipad at Shangri-La. During the flight from Borkray to Manila, we maintained the systolic blood pressure of 95 with adequate blood oxygen saturation with intranasal oxygen before we reached St. Luke Hospital in Manila. Our helicopter had a competent team of a doctor and nurse with all advanced life support including cardiac monitors and ventilator. He had polytrauma and surgical prioritization depends on the stability of vital signs, clinical evidence of herniation, findings on CT scan, and stable intracranial pressure. He was rapidly deteriorating, so we started an infusion of mannitol and short-term hyperventilation en route to the CT scan to prevent secondary brain insults, especially brain swelling. The patient needed four weeks of vigilant support care in the ICU, including perfusion, pressure management, adequate ventilation, infection control, nutritional support, and physiotherapy. Once stabilized, we transferred him back home to the United States on commercial flight stretcher arrangement by Philippines Air. Physical, mental, and occupational rehabilitation in a well-equipped center in the United States helped the patient to recover completely. We just talked to the patient today morning, and he is healthy and hearty. Thanks to the team and the family support.